This is how to burn a CD. So when you when you're done doing your track and you want to burn it into a CD, you could do the Windows Media Player. But I always look at this as the easier way to do it. It's the Roxio Creator DE. I, don't, I think DE means device, so I don't know what DE is. But okay. So now you go audio. You go to the copy CD. Oh, audio CD, my bad. You go audio CD. And then, so, okay, of course, remember, you have to go find your um, track. So, you go to your folder or wherever you know you put your audio track. In. Let's say I want to burn that track. Okay. You drag it to there? Yeah, just drag it. And you could put how many you want. You could do this. Okay, so now you hit this thing right here okay. the orange button. But yeah, it'll pop up. I didn't put in a blank C, but it pops up. Okay, okay. Um, once you hit okay, and once you hit burn, you can't take it out. So, okay, whatever. So, after you press that button, you should burn. It should be burning. It only takes a minute or less than a minute. So, it depends on how long it is. And you could even make copies too, but in this drive, in this computer, you only have one drive. So you can't actually make copies, but in the other side you can make copies, DVDs and stuff. One that knows how to do that, so that should be no problem. Okay.